Alright. <clears throat> Welcome back. So, let's think real quick. One, two, three. Yeah, I think that's gonna work just fine for sinking. So, where are we going? This way? Or, alright, which way was? Okay, that way. So, it's down here. Oops. I'm still used to the controls from the first game. Comstock came by the wagon at dawn. Man was just. He just transfixed by my trophy scalps. Asked about the white ones there. I said, Well, sir, if your quarry dwells in the jungle and beds down with the local color, why split hairs? <laughs> Not a chuckle out of him. Either he ain't seen a man go native, or maybe. maybe too many. Anyhow, now he's got me hunting down this Daisy Fitzroy. Hope we don't expect me to stuff and mount her. <laughs> yeah. I am wondering what's the deal with this Daisy Fitzroy person that everybody seems to hate. Uh, let me see. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's... Man. Hmm. Doesn't seem to want you to change the... Not that I would want to, but I'm wondering why it doesn't seem to uh, to have any kind of subtitles for the the what are they called? Vox what, the, the audio logs. I don't know. Yep. Okay. This way. Up here. What was that? Silver Eagle. <clears throat> oh, my throat. Ahem. I don't trust these mechanical horses. Then again, that would be kind of the perfect thing for my robot army. Right in on a robotic horse. I mean, the symbolism is just perfect. Rushing in a new world order. Comstock fights the serpent of nations. Who the heck is that supposed to be? Creepy vibe all of a sudden. Sure, a lot of crows around. Oops. So footsteps I'm hearing. This doesn't look particularly fresh. John Wilkes Booth. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Who the heck is that? chance to, to do it peacefully. Uh, all I was gonna do was just ransack their home and have to start shooting at me. And when the angel Columbia gave onto the founders the tools to build a new Eden, they did so without hesitation. For 85 years they prepared the way of the Lord. But 
When the great apostate came, he brought war with him. And the fields of Eden were soaked with the blood of brothers. The only emancipation he had to offer was death. banquet going on but apparently it was a while ago because all their food appears to be spoiled. Now I count it's just like sitting in a bunch of piles all across the table. Reminds me of the dwarves from The Hobbit. Pretty good movie by the way. I'd recommend it. Especially if you're a fan of the Lord of the Rings films which I am. What have we got here? The prophet led us into Pei where we demonstrated to the sorrow below the true mission our founders had given us. And when the mad and hypocrites of Washington betrayed him, our prophet did not heal. He did not come crawling for their forgiveness. Like our father's broke with the great apostate. Our prophet broke with these so-called patriots. And today is the day we celebrate this secession. Okay. You do that. You go ahead and celebrate your secession. And I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. First, anything over here, or is this just another way to get down the stairs? It would appear so, but what do we have over here? I'm just passing through. Just passing through. Don't want any trouble. Close Crap. In. Ah, you jerk. Okay, and I'm stuck. Ha <laughs> Somebody. There you go. <laughs> Shoot some stuff in the head. Like a good man, he knows when he's outlived his usefulness. And there was a pineapple in there. I like pineapples. Especially on pizza. Doesn't sound all that appetizing, at least it didn't to me at first, but now it's like one of my favorite pizza flavors. I mean, the sweetness of the pineapple just goes really well with, like, the, uh, the 
sweetness of the ham and the uh, the tanginess of the sauce. Definitely recommend it. What exactly was the great emancipator emancipating the Negro from? From his daily bread, from the nobility of honest work, from wealthy patrons who sponsored them from cradle to grave, from clothing and shelter. And what have they done with their freedom? Why, go to Finkton and you shall find out. No animal is born free, except... Oh, what is this? Uh, okay. The white man. And it is our burden to care for the rest of creation. Right, I found the key to the chest. Alright, so... Do I gotta, like, really go all the way back? Uh, I have no idea. I guess so. I mean, better safe than sorry, right? Than to keep going forward only to realize that I can't go back. I got some salt. Alright, um, oh crap. And they appeared out of nowhere. Nope, I don't hear anything. I don't hear anything at all. Hazard Bay. Real pistol. <laughs> I am so sadistic. Building? I'm not sure. I think so, yeah. That was upstairs, right? I think. Wait, is this the building? I, I can't remember. Hang on. Um, I think so. Where's the stairs? I'm pretty sure this is the building. Those two are, right? I, the, I think that was the same building. I don't remember. Um. Hmm, let's see. Or was it over there? It might have been over there. Yes, I think it was. Alright, uh... Let's see, where's that chest? There we go. Salt and an infusion. Uh, let's see... Shield, health, or salts? Uh, I'm gonna go with salt. Feel better already. Indeed. I think you're on that I found that. Alright, back we go. Oh crap, uh, I almost fell there. 
Saw that poster. Uh, okay. Lockbox. All right, back this way. I do kind of wish you could carry some salt containers with you better than the, like, first aid things, like in the first game. I don't know, I guess it's not a huge deal. I mean, I think most first-person shooters are like that anyway, is where you don't really carry recovery items with you like that. I guess it's not really a big deal. Um, this way, apparently. Okay, this way. There we go. Alright, everybody's still dead in here, at least. Or did some more cultists get sent us back up? Okay. Okay, they came at me. I was minding my own business. I do wish they had let me throw the that baseball at the dude, that racist guy. But I mean, other than that, I was I was minding my own business. I didn't do anything to anybody. No idea what that says. I believe that's that silly old Latin language. These vending machines creep me out, they really do. It's like every time I see it, I'm like, oh, holy crap, what the heck is that? Oh, it's just a robot guy thing. with all the crows. Also, is it me or is there something behind there? Am I meant to go that way? Nope. Alright, what do we have here? Gear is special clothing that grants you unique abilities. You can only wear four pieces at a time, one for type. And your gear from the gameplay menu. New pants. Fire where jumping from a skyline has a 100% chance to burn nearby enemies. Victims take 400 damage over three seconds. Nice. Here's new meaning to the term hot pants, huh? Sell us for. I think I can guess. Alright, meant to go that way, 
so... Oh, no, we're not. Let's go this way. Or that way. Not this way. You know what I mean. Coffins. Slightly odd if you ask me, but okay. And don't look you more propaganda. Not really sure what this is supposed to be. Comstop for I I couldn't even see what that said. I was like they're brainwashing people or something. Chinese prisoner. Holy crap. Okay. Regrettably, I could not save him. Who the heck was that guy, though? Some vigor he must have. He was able to teleport like that. Okay. Lady, yep. let me pass your test. Okay. We're, oh crap, in a hat. appears directly in front of me. Ha! <laughs> How'd you like that? What's this? Some new kind of vigor? Murder of crows. That's a hell of a thing. I can't help but wonder how these taste. Okay. That came out of nowhere. Press to summon murderous crows. Press. Hold and release to create a nest trap. I mean press. Press what? The fourth wall. You're breaking the fourth wall. Alright, press LT to summon murderous crows that stun and damage your enemies. Hold and release to create a nest trap. Enemies take more damage during crow attacks, so it's basically like the uh, insect swarm from the first game. Uh. Oh wow. There it is. Alright. Not too shabby, wouldn't you say? Alright, I think that's gonna do it for this part, so thanks for tuning in. Remember to check out the League of YouTube Gamers and MPD Nation. More quality Let's Play content. And I'll see you next time.